Hello everybody, how are you? David DeFranco here from DavidDeFranco.com. More and more people lately have been asking me how I design my websites, how I create my websites, and how I manage my website. So today's video is all about that. I'm going to personally show you the service that I've been using since probably at least 2007, and that is Squarespace. Squarespace, hands down, is my preferred design platform and hosting platform because a lot of people probably don't realize that Squarespace is not just design and management it's actually a web host as well so it's kind of in a way an all-in-one package and honestly it's not that expensive I believe plans start at $8 a month but if you want my personal opinion just go with the annual plan that way you get a free custom domain with your purchase alright so anyway the point of this video is to show you how incredibly easy it is to create a website with Squarespace all in less than just five minutes. Okay, so in the bottom left hand corner of the screen, you'll see a timer. In a few seconds, I will start that timer by hitting Command K, and you'll see just how fast and easy it is to create a website. So, here we go. Three, two, one. Boom, the timer is going. Let's open my primary browser, which is Safari. That's my homepage, 9to5Mac.com, because I'm definitely an Apple enthusiast. There's no secret about that. So let's go to Squarespace, and on the home page of Squarespace, you'll see these nice, simple layout, basically telling what you can do, telling you what you can do, I should say, in terms of create your own space, create your own anthem, create your own brand, which is what I enjoy, create your own voice, if you're into podcasting or anything like that, create your own idea, create your own canvas, and finally, last but not least, create your own store, because they did just introduce official Squarespace e-commerce supports about six to, six months ago to a year and I gotta say it's pretty impressive so let's click get started and on this page you'll see all of the templates they have now right now obviously you can see it's recommended for and this is kinda of showing all the templates but you can break it down by category such as businesses portfolios stores restaurants and personally which is oh, personal I just mixed up my words personal which is what I personally prefer so let's click on peak because I just love that layout I think it's nice and simple and it works for with what I'm going for so let's start with this design put our information in David DeFranco I'll use DeFranco media at gmail.com uh, put in quick password please wait a moment And my website is there. Welcome to Squarespace. And they show you a video to kind of walk you through the process, which is Welcome pretty cool. You can just click outside anywhere on the screen and it'll, it'll automatically take you to your content manager slash dashboard screen. Okay, so this is your main screen. To click the eyeball takes you to your website. As you can see, this is obviously not my site. I don't do home stock cuisine. The most complex thing I can make is salmon, and that's incredibly easy. So anyway. Point aside. This is your main navigation. So this is where you create your menu, gallery, events. But for this site's purpose, I'm going to delete all these pages because I'm not running a restaurant. So let's do add page. We can do page, products, folder, gallery, which is great if you want to show photography, videos, and it does support video galleries, which is awesome events so this does have a built-in calendar which is awesome blog which I'm going to use for this video's purpose and finally just a single link that could take you to any page of your choice so for this video's purpose let's click on blog now the blog is there we'll just call it David's simple blog we can set that as home page confirm save now if we actually go to the view blog you'll see that the blog page is there aside from the welcome page up here and it's essentially the same thing it appears to be because obviously we haven't added any content yet but we'll do that right now so go back to our management page our dashboard there's big button right here you really can't miss it simply click that add post call David's first post welcome to my blog everyone I hope you enjoy so let's save and publish. 
Now we can view the blog and the post will be there. There it is, David's first post and we can click that to only view that post. Welcome to my blog everyone, I hope you enjoy. So going back to your main dashboard screen, you could do so much more. Obviously I'm just scratching the surface. Squarespace is huge, there's so much to do. So here you can view your traffic analytics. This is great if uh, you want to view your page views, uniques, your robots that crawl your website you know, from sites such as Google, Bing, Yahoo. You can do refers to see where your people are coming from, where your viewers are coming from, uh, your page views I should say. Now here are your settings. You can take control of general, time, connected accounts, you can do your social accounts, Facebook, share buttons, contributors, you can actually add people to help with your site. Domains, this is where you can link existing domains such as DavidDeFranco.com. You can change your template at any time. So for some reason I'm not happy with Peak, I can change it to Marquee or Marquee, however you say that, or Five. And import, export, code injection, and there you go. My timer is up, but as you can see, we even had time to spare after creating my blog post. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions about Squarespace, feel free to ask right below. Again, use that link in my video description for a 14-day free trial. And disclaimer, that is my affiliate link. I do get paid per sign up, but that's just me being transparent with you guys because I greatly appreciate your support. And again, if uh, you have any questions or feedback, just post right below. I'm always happy to help. And um, by the way, if you need any domains, check out the francohosting.com. Yes, that's obviously my own hosting service, but it's incredibly cheap if you want to get started on your domain. But again, do not forget, if you do sign up for an annual account with Squarespace, you get a free custom domain. So in my opinion, that's probably the best route to take. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for your continued support, and I'll see you in my next video.